Okay, so this is Visit With My Dementia Mom Part 2. The earlier part, I was getting ready and I baked her a little cake and everything. And I got that phone call from the nursing home saying that she has not had a good day yesterday. She was groggy and not responsive and did not eat, which for her is not good. For anybody, like I've been a nurse before. For anybody who's been a nurse knows that that's not good. Anybody who's dealt with an elderly knows that that's not good when they stop eating. Um... Especially when they were a real good eater. And then today she's also not very responsive, very groggy, and not eating. So we're walking in knowing that we might not be able to visit, number one. If we do be able to visit, it might be not pleasant, too. So if you're not down with that, then walk away right now. And three, it might be the last time we ever see her alive. I'm sitting here thinking before I go in, and I remember on my visit on her birthday, um, no, before her birthday, she said, I uh, had said something, I will look up the date and put it right there. Uh, she had said something about, um, and there will be my birthday, and then, then that will be about it. As far as visiting, um, she had wanted to go back to her room, and she said this weird thing. And I was like, if I visit on her birthday, is that going to be about it? Like, the last visit for me or for her? Or who's gone down? So... Maybe it was her, so let's go find out. So we're inside. I had to call the front desk to get in, and um, I had to uh, mask up. And now I'm waiting on this one girl to tell me if I can even go visit. She can't come out to visit, maybe? Or, um, you know, we haven't been allowed back there for a while. I'm in this cute little lobby nook area, and uh, I think I might continue this in a second video. So I'm in a third video. We'll see what happens. Hang on a second. Oh, this does not sound good. This does not sound good. Stay tuned for part three. Three coming up.